Thank you so much, Gordon. Uh, I will try to be as short and as possible. Uh, in his uh, address yesterday evening, the Polish Prime Minister said that uh, Gdansk is no more European uh, than uh, Dubrovnik, or he said Dubrovnik is as European as Gdansk. I cannot agree more with this. Uh, and with that in mind, uh, this region, this part of the wall, is an inseparable part of Euro Europe and should be an inseparable part of European Union. It is therefore crucial that uh, the so much talked about enlargement fatigue is not allowed to prevail over the crucial advantages and gains that uh, an early enlargement of the EU towards Western Balkans, towards Southeast Europe, does bring. It is important and critical that uh, a clearer and more tangible EU perspective is provided as it would be a pow powerful incentive for all the kinds of reforms that individual countries need to accomplish in order to meet the uh, required benchmarks. And by all means, I, I do share the views uh, expressed here that visa liberalization for the rest of the, uh, of the Southeast European countries for the rest of the Western Balkan countries is a critical uh, incentive, a critical tangible incentive. As well as uh, I would say the so much talked about screening process due for 2011, which should include, should cover all the Western Balkan countries definitely including the Republic of Kosovo. Regional cooperation is rightly uh, underscored as a, uh, an issue of critical importance as the southeastern European countries or Western Balkan countries move uh, forward towards the European integration. It is uh, so important, it is indispensable that the, re the region does cooperate. Countries of the region do assist one another as they pursue this important goal and do not, namely, seize throwing, throwing up additional roadblocks on the way of one another because that does delay uh, at the end of the day the, the, the enlarged, namely the integration of the whole of the region. By throwing up additional roadblocks on the way of one another, we in fact delay the uh, enlargement, namely the integration of ourselves. It is uh, crucial, I said, that we in the region cooperate between us. And uh, Speaking on behalf of my own country, the Republic of Kosovo, uh, we do have excellent relations with all the uh, countries in the immediate neighborhood, and we equally look forward to having uh, equally good relations with our neighbor to the north, the Republic of Serbia. That is the only immediate neighbor of ours that unfortunately we do not have any any communication whatsoever. Uh, Kosovo is ready to normalizing relations with the Republic of Serbia. It does not mean that Serbia has to formally recognize Kosovo. And Antonio, my good friend, as far as I'm concerned, I can take off to, where was it, Azerbaijan, with uh, Vuk Yeremis tomorrow. Uh, so long that uh, uh, given and provided that Vuk Yeremis would, uh, would agree to that. Uh, Kosovo is looking 
forward to the ICJ ruling and uh, the immediate aftermath of it. And Kosovo will do whatever it takes to meet the expectations on the part of so many countries that have helped us immensely to come to what we, where we are. And uh, on that, I can assure you that who, whoever seeks uh, a dialogue between Kosovo and Serbia on a wide range of practical issues of mutual concern and importance is knocking at the open doors in Kosovo. Uh, the one thing that we cannot and will not uh, discuss is our independence. The one thing that we can never negotiate away is our independence. And uh, anything else is, uh, is uh, absolutely subject to discussion because there will always e eternally be issues which need discussion between uh, neighboring countries. Let me conclude by, by appealing uh, once again on the five remaining non-recognizers with the European Union to do that as soon as possible. Because uh, I can assure you that by recognizing Kosovo, you in fact equally help Kosovo and Serbia. Uh, it may sound paradoxical, but maybe in a way you more help Serbia by recognizing Kosovo than, Serbia, than Kosovo itself. I thank you so much by once again uh, uh, expressing my optimism that, uh, that the region will become part of European Union rather sooner than later and by saying that the gains of bringing in the region sooner than later are much greater than, than the losses. Thank you so much.